Hey guys, Rupos here and welcome back to some more GTFO information. It's been a long while and I have been trying to put this video together. It's probably going to be a short one, but hey ho, it's all about the different uh, monsters that or enemies or I guess the horde like monsters we could be potentially facing in this game. I don't think the full list of monsters has actually been released, but we have a few, I guess, monsters that have been uh, released in various gameplays that we've already seen. So, first of all, we're going to kick it off with the grunts. They're basically your quick charge, crawling towards enemy, <laughs> towards players even, not the enemies, or they're crawling into themselves. But they're the ones that you'll be facing pretty much at the front of the pile. They'll be the ones charging at you, trying to make you panic a lot more. Although it doesn't take much to kill all these grunts. They're actually pretty much just really easy to kill. But they will be a lot of them causing a lot of panic with the players, creating a lot of chaos. And you will need to handle them pretty quickly if you want to i guess survive these kind of enemies we also have an enemy type called snatchers now these i believe haven't been shown in any of the gameplays but what we do know about them is that they use tentacles to latch on to players and drag them away just like one of the enemies from left the dead and i can't remember what that enemy is, oh, I think it's, um, is it the smoker? No, it's definitely not the smoker, I don't know. But it's definitely like one of the enemies from Left of the Dead where it just picks you up and then just holds you. But this one actually drags you away from their team and just absolutely mental if that. They could just be lurking anywhere and all of a sudden you're being dragged away. <laughs> and your team are going to have to pretty much find you and bring you back to the world. Well, I doubt they'll kill you, but they just want to get you back into the fray before the horde of grunts decide to charge you once again. Uh, there is also another enemy, and this, I believe, is a placeholder for a name, and what they're known is called Shadows. What are Shadows? Well, these are invisible, and you can only see them by shining your light on them, basically giving you that terrifying thrill of horror games and that's not the only way you can see them you can use your shine it your flashlight and you can also use your scanner that you may have this is completely mental if this has been made into the game developers have also started that they have many 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 more enemies that they just wait into reveal and they also have many planned for the future, so that's insane if they're coming up with shadows that can just be invisible and just, they'll be there and you won't be able to see them until they're basically on top of you. The grunts are going to make it a lot harder for you to get through to the levels because they're just going to be swarming. Think of it as World War Z when they're just, a lot of them just charging at you, easy to kill and just charging at you. <coughs> Snatches, as I said, pretty interesting. I want to throw some ideas out there. I, I kind of like, I guess like a, a bloater, where there's there's this there's just one that's just so big, and it just explodes on impact if it gets close to enemies. There are zombies like that in Left of the Dead, which just explode and just cause that gunk. Like that. I guess it's the um, the, the uh, liquid that attracts the zombies into that game but something like that that would be pretty interesting if you get that all over you grunts just come charging at you from everywhere that I do like the sound of and it's pretty interesting and obviously we have a load more I guess we have like we could have enemies that actually carry weapons like they like in uh, Resident Evil there was that one giant guy that carried I guess the uh, engine block 
on a axe kind of weapon, something like that, but not to that extent, obviously. But just just the zombies or enemies that are monsters that just carry weapons with them. Obviously, don't know how to use them. They'll just throw their arms about and obviously hit you with their weapon. That would be pretty fun to see if anything like that happens. I don't know. What are your thoughts on this? If you did, leave a like on this if you liked it. And if you did, leave a like, you know, leave a like. And subscribe for more GTFO coming your way very soon. I also have Pokemon Sword gameplay coming in a couple of days' time. The game comes out in, on Friday, and I'm going to be doing a playthrough through that. And I also have guides coming out for Star Wars Fallen Order. So that will be pretty interesting to come out very soon. So... Be sure to stay tuned for more on the channel, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.